Let's get you all caught up with what we've been doing this weekend. It's time for the Kid Craddock Morning Show Morning Newscast with your favorites, Kelly Raspberry, Big Al Mac, Ana Castillejos, Nick Adams, Trey Peart, and part-time Justin. I'm Jose Roberto Ángeles Catam López Chávez de Pérez, and here with the lead story is that wonderful haired man, Nick Adams. <laughs> Thanks, Ted. After being frozen indoors for an entire week, my in-laws offered to come over and watch our kids for a few hours so my wife and I could go out for a much-needed date. Thanks to everything that has happened in the last 12 months, this was our third date and third time away from our kids in over a year. And we're getting reports that some say this could go down as the lamest date in history. Oh. (laughs) Yes, we went to dinner. That was great. But by the time we were done eating, we knew the kids weren't even in bed yet. So we had some time on our hands. We walked around Target. (laughs) Then we walked around... We walked around Home Goods. That's what? That's a dream date. Is this a dream date, Kelly? Yes. We, we stopped and got the screws tightened on my glasses. That's not exciting, but still. Oh, man. And after all of that, we still had time on our hands, so we went grocery shopping. Nice. Mm. Yes. Wow. Our first time out of the house, we went crazy, went grocery shopping, and we did not go to our normal grocery store. No, we no. went to the one a little further away That's to get exciting. the lactose-free yogurt I like. Nice. Of course you did. And by the time we were done grocery shopping, we still had time to oh spare. Gosh. So we went to a random parking lot and uh, <clears throat> hey watched, watched Netflix. Oh. <laughs> while and eating yogurt? <laughs> while, while eating some yogurt and drinking some lactose-free chocolate milk we had gotten my son. What time did you go to dinner? Like four? It was like five or six. <laughs> After about 30 minutes, we went back home and were snoozing by 9.30. Some might call it lame, but we loved it. Not me. Oh, That's all for now. Back oh, to you. Ted. Over to you, Big Al Mac. Thank you, Wolf. It was a rather lonely weekend as far as girlfriend interaction was concerned for Big Al. Because of the weather and her work schedule, they have not been able to see each other for a week, maybe longer. But hopefully today will be the day that they will see each other again. In fact, Big Al, in his loneliness, sent this video to his new boo just last night. I am so happy I get to see my girlfriend tomorrow. I thought I would do a little dance and sing a little song. I am so happy to see my girlfriend tomorrow. I love you, baby. Oh, pretty pathetic. Yeah. But. I love it. Hold on. I love it. The reactions around the, the room are hilarious because Anna's over here about to cry. That's Kelly's so over here shaking her head. It's like, what is this guy doing? Nick's laughing. Justin's smiling. That's Do you always so have your cute. clothes off when you send her videos? <laughs> first video I've ever sent her right there. Very All right, so first Kelly, one. if Alan sends you that type of video, how do you respond to that? I, I don't mind. He's, he used to. Uh, call me and leave me songs. He'd sing to me, and I would yeah. do it. To, you know, just to, you know, it was just sweet. But I wouldn't share those on the radio. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, 